And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Come on. Let's see what we got going on here. Shelves are pretty sturdy. We could climb up. Uh, but there's no way out through the ceiling. Damn ceiling. There's on the way. Let us out now. Could there be a hole behind these pallets? Not gonna help. No such luck. They're not gonna open the door. Ooh, there you, we go. You think a fucking apocalypse? <sighs> I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get- uh, 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 Easy! Uh, oh, God. Dad? Oh. No! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! If he's dead... He's not dead! You know what has to happen, Lee. Think about it. Ugh. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, 300 pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! Lily can still save him. I wish she could, believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. Fuck. Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. Wake That's up. Really... Come on. Uh, Lee. Is he breathing at all? No. No, I don't think so. Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn! You're putting all of us at risk, you son what? of a bitch! You're fucking worthless, Lee. Three. Oh! No! Kenny, I'm so what the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. You just brained him with a I'm salt sorry. lick. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! Are you okay? Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. Shh. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad, don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. I don't wanna hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we gotta have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. You talk a big game, but could you do the hard thing if it was Katja or Duck? It's never gonna come to that. Not if I have anything to do with it. For all we know, the St. John's might have- No! They, they need Katja, remember? She's the whole reason they brought us here. And no doubt they're using Duck as a bargaining chip. I hope you're right. I know I'm right. I just gotta get to him. That's all. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Mm-mm. -mm. 
All right, who's got a coin? Do you have a coin? He was still lively. He was still alive. I'm sorry, Lily. I truly am. Larry and me, we might not have got along so great, but I know he would have done anything to protect you. He was a good father. <laughs> I think I may have found a way out of here, but I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something... No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> Do what you have to do. Oh, boy. <laughs> yeah. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? Huh. He still carried his wallet. My mother's. Don't worry, I'm not taking it. Here we go. Two quarters and a dime. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. Really? Just hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. Grr. Just two screws. Just like that. That is not secure at all. Well, here's our way out, Lee. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. You uh, think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. So what can I use to kill with, if I must? Ooh. <laughs> I love it. Ooh. Cattle prod? Yes! 
zap a bitch. Not quite as good as killing, I suppose, but uh, what do I have to do? Well, we're gonna go out. Let's go. Come on, let's go out. All right, fine, I'll talk to Kenny. What the hell do you think you're doing? Getting my family back. What are you gonna do? Walk up and grab his gun? Good a plan as any. This is not going to end well. Dad, what are you doing outside the barn? Oh shit! Just guarding the place like you said. Man, we sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. And I pick which one to keep in the house. Not the kid. Not enough meat on the trail. Oh, I know, Mabel. This is hey, my favorite keep your eye on too. When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> they never even look down. Lee. Sick fucker thinks this is a game. Yeah, oh shit! Taze him, taze him! Yeah. Oh! Yeah, girl! Thanks, Brick. Understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Give part of yourself so others can live. I should fucking kill you right now. Mark never volunteered to be food. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like you didn't kill Jolene. You don't have what it takes. <laughs> Fucking coward. Uh, yeah. Ah! This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you. Oh shit, now I'm glad I didn't, because she was watching. I kinda had a feeling she was watching. I'll cover you. Just stay here and keep Clementine safe. I'll be right back. It's not on. Oh, what's up, girl? Carly, 
Lee? Ow! Shh! Is everyone okay? You guys have been gone way too long. They attacked us! I knew it! I told you we couldn't trust them! Shit! How many of them are there? Two left! Where? Larry's dead! They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us! Shit! Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. He'll be fine. Oh, no. I'm gonna take the boy and check around. No, please don't take my boy. Let's go, woman. Set him down. I don't want to hurt y'all. Andy, Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? I left Danny in the bar. He got what he deserved. Oh God. <laughs> Coming for you, woman. Don't come in here. You just had to go snooping around, didn't you? Let her go, Brenda. Please, please don't you take another step. Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Come here, woman. I just want to talk to you. Stop right there. I mean it. Oh, oh. I told you to stop. I told you. I did. <laughs> I let go of the button. You had to go snooping around, didn't ya? I don't go, Brenda. All right, so I guess I'll have to inch my way then. Please, please, don't you take another step, Brenda. Come on now, you know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Think about what you do. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. <laughs> Inch. 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 Stay back! Don't do anything stupid! Let her go, Brenda. Please, don't do it. I'll do it! Please. Don't make this any worse. Just stop. They took Doug. Where's Teddy? I said, don't move, asshole. Don't you fucking hurt him. Oh my god. Let him go, goddammit. Oh. That ain't gonna happen. Andy, don't! Shut up! Ah! <sighs> Andy! Who the fuck do you people think you are? Look at what you've done! Shut the fuck up. You think I'm playing here, boy? <laughs> All we wanted was gas! We came to you peacefully! Oh. 
Box them ears. Box them ears. How you feeling, buddy? You feeling all right? How you feeling now? You need a moist pellet. I have one on my fist. There you go. Enjoy. Which side is it gonna be? Which side is it gonna be? You got me. <laughs> you ain't shit. It's over. Fuck you. As soon as Danny Mama get out here, you, you all fucked. <laughs> I said it's over. Just walk away. Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! What are my options? I can kick him in the head. And walk away. Well, Clementine's sitting there watching. I can't do it in front of her. I just can't. I know I should. Get back here and fight me like a man, Lee! Lee! This session may run just a little bit longer than normal because I think this is going to be the end of the episode. So we're just we're just going to go until we go. say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Yeah, and Clementine almost ate some. But? I stopped her. I can't leave her alone, Carly. This fucking world now, it's hiding just unspeakable shit at every turn. Katja managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. <clears throat> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? You murdered Larry. Fuck you, man. You're alive because of me. Why didn't you have my back? I saved your wife and kid. No, I saved them. By making sure Larry didn't kill us. I couldn't do it, Ken. Well, maybe we should stay out of each other's way for a while. Maybe we should. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, 
Are those bad people dead? We didn't kill them, so I don't know. They might have been able to get away from the walkers. But I'm sure they won't be coming after us. That's good. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. You're not exactly keeping away from me, are you? Hmm? I think you have a crush on me, don't you, Ken? Admit it. It's okay. You can have a bromance. Don't shoot! We're here to help! Am I gonna get bit? Get eight? No. Figures. Oh, crap! Baby, you gotta see this! It's a mm -hmm. shitload of food and supplies back here! This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? What if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? <sighs> we gotta live, kid. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but it's not about right and wrong anymore. It's about survival. Mm -hmm. Great. Maybe we'll survive this after all. Duck, why don't you carry this? Okay. Supplies? I'll take it. More food in here. <laughs> Got a box of food here. I'll carry it. This hoodie looks to be about your size. Why don't you hold on to this? It might get cold. It's not mine. <sighs> We're not like the bandits, honey. We didn't hurt anybody to get this. Understand? I guess so. Hey, oh, sorry. there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. We gotta do what we, we gotta do, kid. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Quiet down, train. Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Oh, shit. Sweetheart, we won't let them bandits get you, will we? No. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. 
when did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If Y'all I find thinking it, you're I'll safe? Let you know. Sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you gotta be afraid of. The people I used to call friends. The people who do. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I promise. <laughs> This place is done. It's time to move on. Screw it. Not like you ever listen to a damned word I say. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much face is on it. It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to, and you know it. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. This is crazy! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. So 55% of people actually, or not 55, but 45% actually did not take the food. Wow. Why? It's. I understand it's a whole idea, you know, trying to be the good guy and whatnot, but you gotta survive. You gotta eat. You can't eat the people. You just have the whole thing about not eating people. I don't know. I'm confused. <laughs> but that was a fantastic episode, and I can only imagine what's going to come next. I am ready. But that's not for tonight. Tonight, we end it here. Thank you very much for watching. And we will catch you in the next episode.